Welcome. Welcome to Crab's Treasure. You're gonna see. You're gonna have E.P. Ryland. I can finally hear it. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, my headphones on. Yeah, you can finally hear the voice acting. Yeah, his voice doesn't do it. No. Anyone? I. I've, Anyone? <laughs> can you hear me? I'm still left in the dark. Um, but yes, uh, audience at home. I'm, but we're going to be for this recording session banking on Alex Charisma here. Oh, Jesus. I have to walk. Oh, God. We're banking on Alec. And TJ's here. I am here. Because I'm EP. <laughs> I'm EP and need sleep. Okay. Oh, no. TJ has TikTok. What's up? I, this isn't about TikTok. Oh, okay. Right? Go. I just want to I've ordered clothes, right, for, like, um, Supernova. Yeah. Do you know who I'm going as? Yeah, you've told me. Can I show you my outfit? Sure, go ahead. I'm just so excited. Go ahead. So excited. I find it cool that you guys are embracing the whole cosplay aspect of it. That's cool. Fuck yeah, I am. I wish I had the money to. Then I would. Hey, look. It's the Look at chest. all the money we would have had. Oh my god. Look at all those Benjamins. So I he doesn't fit either. I actually got the toga outfit. Oh wow. I couldn't find like where I could get the top from. Yeah. And like the oversized cardigan yeah. outfit. So I actually got the actual cosplay. Yeah. I got some fake knives. Nice. You are knives. you are gonna have to um state when you go into the security that they're fake and they're gonna have to like hold yeah. it briefly for a amount of time. Well, they're plastic. Yeah, but they have still but like like to make sure that they know it's fake. Oh, Mine's a big like rubber this. sword. <laughs> Fair um, this is his sword. Wait, let me get a. No, not that one. It's the plastic one. That's the big one. It's the big rubber one. That one. That's so cool. Um, so he so, so you're got. I feel I feel like it's a bit inappropriate though, because like you're tall, he's short. Yeah. <laughs> there he goes. He's got the actual outfit as well and the wig. You were better. <laughs> you were better soon going for what's his mate's name. Barn. Barn. You were better going I for thought Barn. About and I was like, I'm going to be cold as shit. <laughs> <laughs> true. <laughs> Just very true. And I got the little fang thing so I can make my own fangs. The you toga, your toga. toga yeah. I do like Barn, but so I don't want to be cold. That's fair, yeah. Anyway, so that's for day one, right? Yeah. Plus, I have... God, it must be so nice having a job that pays so well. <laughs> I think you're meant to die here. I get a feeling yeah. you're meant to die here. It <laughs> <laughs> must be so nice having a job that pays well. Plus, I have the garter. Oh, I know. Where does that go? Your leg. Okay. It's a garter. I don't know what that is. Oh my god. Even I knew what it, it was. Like, it holds up like socks or stockings okay that makes sense okay but she uses it to put like her blood vials in yeah yeah, yeah no i've yeah i've seen the show yeah right for day two <laughs> so excited to give to give full context to the people because i realize we don't have face cams and we're doing completely audio uh alec and tj are going to supernova which is a huge thing yeah. that happens in wa um, actually all of Australia, <laughs> now that I think about it. Um, and first day, TJ's going as Toga, and Alex going as, what's his name again? Meliodas. Meliodas. And second day? I'm going as Misa. And Alex going as? Meliodas. 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 He only has one plus way. Boring! I can I be know. a Krillionaire. Yep. And then? I can be a Krillionaire. <laughs> I have nice. two different outfits for me, so that I'm not sure what one I'm going to like best. Depends on how this dress fits me. Okay. But 
I got the black stockings because she wears black stockings yeah, yeah. with the black dress. Yeah. So I've got this black dress. Not bad. Um, or I've got when she wears her red skirt, the red and black pleated yeah. skirt. Yeah. And she wears it with like a black singlet. And nice. A red corset. Nice. I've got that. I've also got the gloves. And the garter for the other side. Nice. And I've got these little gothic dagger earrings. Nice. Cute. I got this choker because. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. I got this other necklace to layer. Nice. Because me And. I got this red lipstick to make it look like blood for Togo. Nice. When is Superman? <laughs> End of June. End of June. Nice. Okay. And I got these boots for if I wear the black dress. Nice. I'm so sad. That's awesome. And she just can't hide it. Yeah, fair enough. Bad to lose control. And I think I like it. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, the only time I ever cosplayed as Supernova was a few years ago. I went as the 11th Doctor. Matt Smith's Doctor. From Doctor Who. Mm. That was fun. I got the whole Sonic screwdriver and everything. That was pretty nice. cool. You know, I was thinking of going as Barn. And I do like Barn a lot better than Meliodas. I think everyone does. I haven't even seen the anime and I know Bon is better. What? <laughs> but cold. <laughs> it will be very cold. You just don't go shirtless. Go as, like, like, alter the costume to your own will. No. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Anyway, I'm very excited. Nice. Map. Nah, Supernova's fun. I do, I do want to go, um, something I really, really, really want to do now as well, it's, especially because we have, um, we have, I have a friend who is doing TAFE, um, fashion right now, mm -hmm. um, and she's a huge Hasbro Hotel fan as well, so if they are a huge Hasbro Hotel fan, I need to remember for correct pronouns. Um, they're a huge Hasbro Hotel fan as well as me, as well as my other mates who I, they're, they're the ones I do the Friday night gathering with. Mm -hmm. Um, and one of the things I pitched as an idea is one day all of us went to Supernova as Hasbro Hotel characters and they were like, I will make costumes. It's like, sweet. And I said, then I followed up with, if anybody takes Vox, I'm going to kill them. I will go as Vox. Obviously, I won't go because here's the thing: I've seen so many Vox cosplays, and I feel like you just can't do the TV head. You just can't. It's too blocky and like not well done. The best one I've seen, which props to this person, still again look blocky, but they were able to make the screen actually be a screen. So it had like it had like gifs of like Vox's face like moving on the screen that was cool but I've seen a few good ones I've seen a few good ones but they're not but but they didn't follow the TV design they just like made it like if Vox was a human those were good ones I've seen a few good ones with like the TV you got my yeah oh, I think I'm looking in the wrong place then. you're just all, dumb all the ouch <laughs> you just call me dumb yeah just right off rip <laughs> right off rip thanks off rip. Right off rip. Just called me stupid. I hope you're happy. Being stupid. I hope you're happy now. Oh, no. I <laughs> hate. I hate that we clocked <laughs> <laughs> onto that exact that thing. Happening? You died. Yeah, what the hell? Who's the doing? dumb one now? You didn't say what the fuck. He was no one. He was shooting rings at you. He's gone. Bing. Rings of fire. Bing. Hello. Bing. Bing. Hello, Harley. Is he on your blankie? Do you want to take that kelp that was there? Or you can only go for Okay. Let me lift you up. I have kelp. Nice. That one. Upsies. 
on. Oh my god, right? Yeah. And so, on the 3rd of July, I'm getting my tattoos, right? I'm looking for another day of tattoos. Cool, okay. Do you want to know what I'm getting? Sure, shoot. I'm only getting two tattoos this time. Okay. Right? I'm I still don't have the money for one. <laughs> so, I, I would be getting tattoos if I had the money and the time. I actually don't have the time or money. I am getting... Like these two, which is our like birth flowers. Oh, cool. Um, in like a little bouquet on my wrist, just here. Nice. That's just gonna be like fine line, you know. Fair enough. Yeah. Well, just line work. Then I'm getting my back done. Oh God. Something like that. Okay, so <laughs> okay, you open it up with I'm already getting two. To show off, like, I'm only getting two. Then you show me the why you're only getting two. The back one's massive. <laughs> it goes across your whole back. Yeah. That's pretty so, cool. We only think we're going to get the wings, like, the black, the line work. We don't think we're going to get to the red of the wings yet. And we're going to save the dagger for a different day. Okay, fair enough. Well, but your goal is to have that thing on your back. And end game. Goals. Yes, Re um, Relationship goals. That looks awesome. Please equip it. That looks pretty sick. And it's fire. Hell. Yeah. That looks pretty sick. Oh. I'm so excited. And I'm getting my second pierce. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, because, Very right, right, I was going to fix up my hair and get, mm. like, one colour blonde. Yeah. But, um, my hair is a bit too dead for that at the moment. <laughs> so. Yeah. Ow. I used the money that, because I budgeted, right? Yeah. I've been budgeting. And so I used the money that was going to be for my hair. Instead of putting it into savings, like I probably should have done, so I had extra savings. Mm. Whatever. I put it towards my costume and getting my ears pierced after his show. Nice. Um, do you want to know a cosplay that I really want to see both of you pull off just because of how funny the context is behind the two characters and how, if you did do it, I'd get free reign of jokes all the time. Kenji, power. Who? Is that his name? Who's the main character from Chainsaw Man? Denji. Denji from Do. Denji, power. <laughs> Den, uh, do you know do you know Chainsaw Man? I've heard of it. Yeah. Yeah. So the main character Denji, he's the chainsaw guy. Yeah. Um, his whole motivation is just he wants to touch boobs. That's literally his whole motivation. His whole motivation. It's his whole thing. And then. Pa I feel like that's Alex's whole motivation. They see what I mean. It's fitting. And then power is just um. Is a demon. Is a demon. But to give context, the creators have literally said. No, well, yes, but I'm, but I'm also saying, oh, I thought you were going to take it as an insult, in which case, then yes, I find you like Satan. Um, oh, that's such a good compliment. It is. Man. For me, why for only for me? <laughs> because that's like the whole point of our friendship. True, is I yeah. I love you, yeah. and you're meant to be scared of me. I'm not scared of you. Not all demons are scary. Um, but, <laughs> I'm not scared of you. Um, but. Hey. Literally just jumped off it. But um, to give context, the creators have literally stated that Power's personality and characteristics and of like how, how they act is based off Eric Cartman from South Park. I haven't seen the show, so I can't confirm you this. Seen South Park? No, I've seen South Park. I haven't oh. seen Chainsaw Man. <gasps> Denji is based off Eric Cartman. It's Denji. I thought it was Power. Oh, Power is based off Eric Cartman. Powers. Yeah. I don't see it either way. Well, Cartman's a narcissistic asshole. I think Power's a narcissistic asshole. God, Harley tried jumping up on the couch and we could just bonk him on the head like this. <laughs> Funny. Uh, oh, really? Anyway, so I have like 20,000 packages coming in the next two weeks and I'm so excited. 
I'm going to be flat out right here right now. I'm so jealous that you guys have the money to do this shit. <laughs> I don't know how to get up. There. I, I get my paycheck and I'm like, cool, fuel's done, paying bills done, 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 done. Okay, do I have enough to eat? <laughs> See, but when he gets his car, it's going to be like that. That is true. That is true. Yes. Because you're getting what a high lot, aren't you? Is that? No. no? Oh, okay. I thought you were getting company car. No. That um, was just a thing that could happen. Ah, okay. But he is looking at cars to use for work. What are you looking at? Cars. Yeah. Whoa. Just anything. <laughs> just anything. We'll make sure it's a, like a, like a full drive you thing for work because you don't really want to be... <laughs> There's certain, there's certain cars where, I don't know, yeah, unless, unless you want to be a target of a many jokes. Don't, 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 don't buy them. Like, B, like BMWs. If you, if, you, if you ever own a BMW, I'm slapping you. I would be a clown if I did that. Thank, thank God that you see it that way. Sick. She said the thing! <laughs> By the way, first recording session in June. Happy Pride Month, everyone. Happy Men's Mental yeah, Health say, Month. Men's that too. Health that, health. that that for taking over Men's Mental Health Month. I agree with that. Really? It is fully taking over Men's Mental Health Month, and then I've seen barely anything about it. I've seen and one. Yeah. Wow. And like I understand, Pride is such like a big thing, but also so is Men's Mental Health. We have such a big thing about women's mental health and like in the system and everything about how women are like the suicide rates for women are higher than men. But that's because men hide it more because there's nothing about it. There is such a stigma around it that men can't talk about it. And then Pride has just taken over this in the past few years. And the, the one time they get that people are actually reaching out and trying to help them, it's just been taken over and pushed to the side. And I'm very angry about it. I've never felt more cared about in my life. Is, 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 it, is, it, is, it, is it bad that I like, genuinely, I guess this kind of plays into the whole thing of like it's been tracked down. I genuinely forgot it was Mental Health Month. Exactly. People don't talk about it because pride has taken over everything. Yeah. And like I get it. 100%. You do you, boo. Like, <laughs> pride can go off. But taking over something that is so important and that is such stigmatized, like that's horrendous. I think that's horrible for us as a community to do. Yeah. Uh, yeah, actually. Like yeah. we talk about inclusive inclusivity and things, but we're not including that men have mental health and we've just taken over it and they're not getting to talk about it. They don't get the time to talk about it and have people come out and actually help them in this time because everyone's like oh pride like yeah i get it we've like people in pride have been stigmatized against for so long but so is men's mental health it's been stigmatized for longer exactly true very 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 it's true. in my opinion a bit more important yeah i agree i, I think mental health in general is more important it is than exactly. anything. Like, yes, I understand. As a whole, it is more important. I understand that pride plays into, like, people's mental health and whatever. But also, pride is so much more included now because everyone's, like, doing it. Like, not just in Pride Month, where, like, everyone's being included. It's at all times. LGBTQ+, at all times. And then there's still a specific month about it. Really? You don't need the month. Something that's been in the world for so long, Men's Mental Health Month, and it's just been taken over in the past few years just because people got upset that they weren't being included enough. And now they are all year round, and men's mental health is still being pushed to the side. Yeah. Um, on the topic of that, um, I had a f- I very, very recently I went out to see my dad, um, which I, hadn't, I, I, I haven't really seen in person for a bit, and I really should see them more. Um, but we were having a conversation and mental health kind of like, did, like, we, like we dipped toes in that pool. Um, and he actually, he actually, um, cause I said, I said to him, like, I find it weird that like, I can't cry anymore. Like, like I cried very, like I used to be the biggest cry baby when I was a kid. And now I find it so hard to like even shed a tear at most things now. And dad, and this 
threw me so off guard and actually got a bit I, I, I wouldn't say I got emotional but I got, like I felt something he literally said yeah I'm sorry about that I was like why are you sorry he's like because I told you to hide your emotions I was like ah <laughs> cool okay um ooh <laughs> I wasn't expecting that dad uh I was I was here to pick up a letter from the department of transport okay cool um, thanks, Dad. <laughs> thanks, Dad. You know, I love my, I love my dad, but um, yeah, it's because how he was raised, yeah. and so then he, whether he, because he, he didn't flat out like tell us like word for word hide your feelings, but like it was through build up of actions, build up of conversations, build up yeah. of this, that, this, that he it implemented the seed in my brain of like, ah, yes, don't cry. Emotions for weaklings. Emotions. Pfft. Emotions? Who needs them? <laughs> Don't need it. Just put on a smile and wave. Exactly. As the that's penguins of Madagascar yeah, Smile and wave. <laughs> um, like, that's so bad. Yeah. And I'm so annoyed that Pride has pushed it away. When people in Pride talk about inclusivity all the time, but they're not being inclusive right now. Like, I really hate that. Yeah. It, it does suck. It makes me really ashamed of the community. It does. Yeah. It's something I feel very strongly about. Fair enough. And in case, <laughs> yeah, you asshole. And and to and to and to probably end this video on a high note because it is probably over its runtime. To end this probably. video on a high note, you can't attack us for being, you can't you can't attack us for being um, being bigoted or anything because the person who said most of that <coughs> is part of the community. Oh, so yeah, ha, I'm, suck it. And I am ashamed of my community right now. I'm stranded. <laughs> <laughs> You're the only one here. <laughs> I have a straight white I'm male. confusing, and TJ's just by. I am, and I'm very ashamed of my community right now. I think it's disgusting that we're doing this, and we all need to stop. And on that note, next time. <laughs> I'm a straight white male. <laughs> I'm a straight white man. <laughs> Bye. Bye.